if you get this error message in Marvel Rivals, which says the anti cheat system is currently inactive, please review the server configurations or restart the game. Now, in this tutorial, I will guide you on how to resolve this error. Now, the first step you need to try is if you have installed via Steam. So, if you have installed the game, which is Marvel Rivals via Steam, close the launcher now validate the game files then relaunch the game so you just need to close the launcher then validate the game files then relaunch the game so just open steam go to your steam library and right click on your game which is marvel rivals then go to properties go to install files and verify integrity of your game files now after verify the integrity of game files after the verification is over try to launch the game to see if the issue has been resolved now if you're still facing again the same problem now try to reboot your pc also another step you need to try if the issue hasn't been resolved in the launcher settings click the gear icon on the top right corner to open settings then deselect exit launcher when game starts game should now start normally you may have to click this every time you start the launcher through so let me show you so in the launcher settings click the gear icon on the top right to open settings so this is your launcher settings just click on this gear icon to open your launcher settings now after opening the launcher settings then deselect exit launcher when game starts so deselect exit launcher when the game starts so here you need to deselect exit launcher when the game starts now after deselecting exit launcher when the game starts the game should now start normally you may have to click this every time you start the launcher though so if it hasn't been resolved now let's go to the another step which is change launcher settings to allow close launcher minimized to system tray so change your launcher settings to allow close launcher minimize to system tray so like this you need to allow minimal minimize to system tray so on the close launcher here select minimize to system tray and you try to launch the game to see if the issue has been resolved now if you're still facing again the same problem now i have found that moving the game from the second drive to boot main drive fixed the issue so if you still have the problem i've found that moving the game from the second drive to boot main drive fixed the issue so try to move your game to the main drive it will fix the problem so if you have the game on the second drive try to move it to the main drive so this is the best guide on how to fix this problem but you can try which in the launcher settings click the gear icon on the top right to open settings and then deselect exit launcher when the game starts so you need to deselect this exit launcher when the game starts game should now start normally you may have to click this every time you start the launcher though or change launcher settings to allow close launcher minimize to system tray so you need to allow on the close launcher here allow minimize to system tray so this is the best guide on how to fix this issue let me know in the comment section if which which step has helped you thank you so much for watching and see you next time